Shore power refers to the process of providing electrical power to a ship while it is docked in port. This allows the vessel to turn off its onboard generators and use electricity supplied from the shore instead. The primary functions of shore power systems are reducing air pollution by minimizing emissions, fuel savings and noise reductions. By being the full turnkey system integrator, unburdening the customer in the whole project, meaning installation of the substations, the powerhouse, the cable management system, doing all the civil works, doing the communication with distribution system operator, and the integration of the automation and fail-safe system, actually the whole nine yards. Many ports are increasingly integrating renewable energy sources, such as wind, solar and hydropower, into their electrical grids. When ships use shore power derived from these sources, it enhances the sustainability of maritime operations and encourages the broader adaption of clean energy. The implementation of shore power underscores the shipping industry's commitment to sustainability, promoting research and development of low emission technologies and encouraging the adaption of greener practices across the sector. We start with making the connection to, depending on power rating, one or two feeding cells from an existing substation. From these cells, high voltage cables are connected to the powerhouse. The powerhouse consists of a grid side switch gear, a step down transformer, the inverter itself, a step up transformer, and final, the ship side switch gear. Finally, a new set of high voltage cables connects the powerhouse to the cable management system, and thus the ship. The whole installation must comply with ISC 80005, which is an international standard for shore power connections. Here we will install a shore power connection for container vessels with a power rating of 7.5 MW. The powerhouse will be built next to our new substation building. The cable management system will be realized with IGUS, which is a small footprint trolley on rails that can ride along the quayside. We always offer the connection point at the most suitable location. Another big investment is a cable management system. Here we have chosen a system that offers great flexibility with a small footprint, which guarantees only limited operational disruption. We have been involved with industrial high voltage installations for more than 30 years, so no secrets for us there. Often, we already have an installed base at the customer site, which gives us a clear view about what's possible and what's not. Thanks to close contact with the distribution system operator, we know what is possible on a power rating level. In the end, it is one party who is responsible for putting the whole puzzle together, and we are proud to fulfill that role. The biggest challenge in rolling out shore power will be the availability of the electric power itself. Shore power, as you know, asks for a lot of power and does impact the local grid infrastructure severely. We, as an integrator, do have the responsibility to support the customer in making the right choices regarding overall setup. Sure, electrification is helping us towards a more sustainable future, but sustainability also means using common sense and seeing to it that the lights won't go out tomorrow when the ship's plugged in.